evening to you. Thanks so much for joining us tonight at 5. We start tonight almost a month away from the November election. And one group wants to be proactive in bettering Midland by educating residents. The nonprofit known as Move Midland says their goal is to move Midland forward and turn it into a thriving community. The first topic this organization wants to tackle is the $1.4 billion MISD bond election. CBS 7's Noe Ortega joins us with more on this organization. Noe? Many people who live in Midland have given their opinions on the upcoming bond election. However, Move Midland say there's always a second option that they believe will benefit Midlanders. This organization has three solutions that they believe will bring more results than passing the bond, which includes building a new elementary school from the district's $80 million in unrestricted surplus funds, pay down its $200 million in deferred maintenance from their unrestricted budget surplus, and then pass a bond in 2024 to build a third high school, safety, security, and remaining maintenance costs they need. We think we need to address the issues at hand, which is tackling improving our children's education, improving our children's outcome. We can do all of these things while also addressing the facility needs within MISD. Walker says they are supportive of MISD, but feel like the school district should focus more on the educational aspect instead of building infrastructure. And we have reached out to MISD and are waiting on a response about the comments made by Move Midland. We'll hear from their, their response coming up at 6. For CBS 7 First Alert News, I'm Noah Ortega.